How, how big is this season for you? I mean, obviously you came in last year, made a huge impact. Um, you know, you, now it's another year in the system. I mean, how much are you looking forward to having a really good year this year? And I'm looking very forward to it. I'm looking forward to impacting the team in any way I can. So I just feel like this is going to be a great year for me. It's going to be the year that I've been waiting on my whole life. So are there some parts of your game where you feel like you're better than you were a year ago? I mean, obviously, everyone always gets you know, more mature, more knowledgeable, all that stuff. I feel like I improved my playing on, like playing down the field, like running past people more. So I feel like you can expect me to run past more people and you feel what I'm saying? And expect we kept making a lot of plays down the field. What are we going to see when it comes to this UCF offense? I mean, we've heard a lot about John Rice Plumlee taking a huge jump in year two. We've heard about Coach Inshawn throwing the ball down the field more. Like, what are you seeing out there? What are we going to see when the season starts in a few weeks? As I mentioned, me making plays downfield is coming from my coaches wanting me to make plays downfield. So I feel like we're going to push the ball downfield more. You can see up, you can expect a lot of us to be making a lot of plays downfield and just making a lot of explosive plays to help the offense. And explosive plays. I mean, that's something you saw in spring and, and early on so far. Like, we were some, obviously, everyone knows about yourself and Javon. You, you guys are the top two guys, but. There's some other guys that have kind of caught your eye. Or, or, uh, man, I mean, all the guys work, man. Chauncey, X, Mari, JG, Corey, Game H, all the trend, everybody, all, the, all our guys make plays. Every guy in that room make plays, every single one of them, from the walk-ons to the scholarship guys. Every guy in that room deserves a scholarship to my eyes, and every guy in that room make plays. And we're just such a close group, and we just focus ourselves on going out there and make plays. We're the playmakers of the team. You feel what I'm saying? We make the offense go, so I feel like, Everybody in that room make plays. Tell me more about Corey Gamage. He was at Marshall last year. I think he was their number one receiver. What kind of talent is he? What, what kind of role do you think he's going to play on? I feel, what like, kind of he? I feel like he, he's a big target. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. He got strong hands. He's just, he just right now, he coach Cole Hurd pushing him. So, yeah, he's going to be ready for the season. You feel what I'm saying? He's going to be a big impact for us. He's going whenever anybody need, like, he can step in at any spot. He can step in at my spot. He can step in at Javon's spot and make plays. You can expect him to make any play that comes to him. He's going to be a big target. So when the ball is in the air, 90% of the times he's going to make the play. How is John Rice a better quarterback now than maybe he was last season? Like, what are you seeing from him? Because obviously this is a really big year for him to step up. I mean, John Rice drastically made an improvement over the offseason. So I feel like the us as the offense and the coaches is trusting him more, throwing the ball down the field. So I feel like that's putting more improvement and more confidence in him. So he's more confident. Throwing the ball down the field and it's everything he do is looking pretty. He's just looking like a, a big time quarterback. He's able to connect more on those deep balls and, and kind of distribute the ball and all that stuff. Yeah, so he's able to do everything. So any any type of ball, John Rice can any type of throw that the people think he can't make, he can make. He can make any type of throw. He make the the circus throws, the throws right over top of the linebacker's head, the throws sixty yard downfield. He can make any throw that you, you can name. How excited are you for this Big Twelve opportunity? It's on the biggest stage. You get to go. There's some great venues. You know what's on the line. If you win the conference, you're definitely in the college football playoff picture. How excited are you for that opportunity? I mean, I'm very excited. No matter what conference I'm in, I'm going in the season excited. I'm ready for game one, to be honest. I'm ready for game one. When the Big 12 come, they're going to get our best. They're going to get our all. But first of all, we got August 31st. Right. That's what I'm most excited for. But the Big 12, we, they're going to get our all every game. What are you guys talking about? Like, goal-wise, championship? Are you looking for a championship? Like, what, what, what do you mean? We're, we're, we're not going there with our minds narrow. We're going in with a, a wide, open mind. We're going in to win the Big 12 championship. That's our goal when we're coming into it. So, we're not going to go in and limit ourselves just because we're a new opponent. We're just going to go in and – Fight, and I feel like we'll put our ourselves in the chance to win every game we're going to. I mean, I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Good luck to you, Kobe. Thank, Thank you. you.